Hi everyone, it's Melanie. So I just wanted to share a little Amy Tangerine style um, junk journal with you. And I was inspired by Yvonne, who's Yvonne White on YouTube. She made um, an Amy Tangerine junk journal the other week, which she filled with some photographs. And so, and I really liked what she did. So I thought I would give it a go as well. So this is what I came up with. I had some Amy Tangerine embellishments in my stash, which I bought a long time ago, um, which is this one, a slice of good of the good life, <clears throat> and this little piece here, um, and the clouds. The camera I stamped with a stamp set, and I just put a little uh, arrow paper clip here. The uh, craft paper is just an A4 piece of paper, um, sort of cardstock that I folded in half and well actually I've covered up the binding but I did just a normal pamphlet stitch with the linen thread. This is a uh, journaling card is from printed from the internet and I also cut out a piece of acetate which I've sewn into the binding as well and that's on the back but that sticks up quite a lot so I put the um, paper clip on it so I put the camera underneath and then just put this piece over the top so looking inside um, a lot of the papers are from Walnut Grove which is pebbles so I just used my fancy edge scissors there I cut out all different sizes of papers and I did just do a little bit of I have stuck a couple of photographs in um, this is another printout from the internet and this is a picture of my son and daughter and they were playing Monopoly the other day and um, my son gets very competitive when he's playing Monopoly so he's got his business face on there <laughs> So, and then that's another little piece from the Walnut Grove. And I cut out a circle, a long banner. Um, and this is another printout from the internet. I just usually go on Pinterest. Um, you can get lots of free printables on there. This is another paper that I had in my stash. Uh, this didn't have any name on it, but I've got a feeling it might be Lawn Fawn. That's the other half of the semicircle, or the circle rather. And this is a picture of my daughter. She just recently finished sixth form, so uh, she went to a Leavers Ball. And that was just before she went off to that. I put a bit of washi tape there and a little heart, another piece of paper and then I cut out another circle with my scallop, scallop punch and I just attached that to this piece and made that into a tuck spot. This is an envelope which I just did a bit of doodling on. And then this is basically just the other half of the papers. So I'm going to use my doily border punch there. And that's the end. So um, I hope you like that. And um, Thanks for watching and I'll speak to you again soon. Bye.